This is an example using Microsoft Virtual Earth and Photosynth to transition between satellite, aerial, and bird's eye imagery as we zoom in on the Earth down to St. Peter's Basilica in Rome. Notice the three-dimensional object here which is St. Peter's and as we zoom in to the rooftop here we'll transition into Photosynth and then Photosynth will actually tour using the a collection of photos that have already been taken of this area of Earth. Note how we can zoom in very rapidly and change pictures simply by clicking on them with the mouse. These photos are arranged in a three-dimensional view and Photosynth allows them to stream very, very rapidly to the desktop. Note how quick this is. This is just running on a, on a laptop computer. And you can see that it dithers the picture as it comes in, but then you can zoom in and it only shows you those parts of the photo that you're actually zoomed into. So it operates very, very quickly over the internet. Another feature of Photosynth is its ability to orient the pictures, in this case, uh, in this matrix view, that gives you an idea of the pictures that are close uh, in terms of relationship to the picture that you're looking at. It does this by forming a three-dimensional point cloud of uh, individual pixels from each of these pictures so it can figure out wh which ones are related to others. Another aspect here that we're looking at is the ability to, to it, the orange uh, areas are where the cameras were uh, when the individual pictures had been taken. So you can click on any of the cameras and see the, the photo that was taken with that camera. And that's it. Virtual Earth with Photosynth integrated together.